video welcome to my channel today's video is a review slash like honest opinion on the YSL mini Lulu backpack this is what it looks like y'all might have seen it before um but I got this for Christmas a couple days ago I'm so thankful I picked it out I am so so thankful that that is something that I could get for Christmas but I'm not pleased with the product like it's so beautiful but I have complaints that I just wanted to um, warn you guys about if you were looking into the bag because there's things about it that I wish that I knew before having my family spend money on that. Um, I'm gonna return it and probably just not get anything YSL. Nothing really against YSL. Um, I just like the only bags that I like of theirs is the ones that flap and the flap is the problem. But um, anyways, as you can see, this video is a little bit more casual. I'm in a hoodie, my hair is up, I'm congested, and I'm about to run to the airport to fly to New York. So I'm just filming this really quick because I wanted to put it up there for you guys to know. Um, some good information about this bag that is highly sought after. I feel like it's really popular it's sold out in a lot of stores I feel like a lot of people on Instagram have it and um, you know maybe people think it's like amazing they're gonna spend their uh, save up their money to spend on this but I just wanted to give you guys my review subscribe to my channel we are over 15,000 now and that's so awesome also follow me on Instagram um, to see my amazing New York trip that I'm literally running out the door for right now and yeah, let's get into this video. So, pretty much, it's a beautiful, beautiful bag. Um, the material is great and whatnot. Let's take this stuffing out. But, um, so this is the straps. They are some thick black leather straps and they go in this buckle. Here and they're adjustable so you can change the length about four inches. Um, one thing that I really did not like, but this is not the main thing, is um, they have this little tag on it that says, warning, this product can expose you to chemicals including lead and lead compounds, which are known to the state of California to cause cancer slash birth defects or other reproductive harm. And I know for a fact from looking into it that they only put these tags on items that like actually might expose you to it they don't it's not just a general thing you know because i thought maybe it would be a general thing because i almost ordered a jacket once and before i checked out it said that so i looked into it and i was like oh maybe they say that to everyone just as a disclaimer for like their whole site or something but they were like no if it says that it's specific to the product so this specific backpack might give you birth defects and cancer and and other stuff but anyways, that's not even the main problem. Oh, and it says um, Saint Laurent, like in here. It's a great size, right? So you can see the size. But the problem here is that it, they, I just really don't understand the um, clipping situation. I think I'm actually gonna change angles so you guys can really see what I'm talking about. I'm gonna do it like looking down at the bag and the problem that we have with it is that um okay so here's the bag and the issue is first of all it they made it with this string because there's no other way to close this so i guess they thought this string would be a good idea okay so let's say we use the string now this is right in front of here you have to spread it open and you would think oh that's fine just close it but no, so every time you want to use your purse, do you want to have to maneuver this open, try and get this closed? Are you seeing what's happening? There's no, like, I don't want to mess this up because I'm going to return it. But it's virtually, like, impossible to get this clip. And, like, every time you want to close it, you want to be wrestling it like this? I don't really think so. Like, maybe if you really, like, get down and squish it, it's still not clipping. So, <laughs> hey, I kind of just think it's not functional. Like, it's very cute, but for the price that they 
th this bag is, like, you don't want to have to be wrestling it closed every time you want to close it. You know, like, you buy something, okay, step aside at the cash register, wrestle it closed for a minute. Like, it's just a bad system going on with this. But, like, okay, let's say that you want to, like, do it down like that to get it out of the way. You still have to use two hands to squish this close and then somehow spread this open and then try and clip it. And it like, it just doesn't clip easily. Like, I'm not sure if you, it's still, it doesn't even clip. I don't know guys, I just really wanted to, okay, this just suddenly got like so casual um, vlog style, but I really just wanted to show you guys that because I feel like a lot of like Instagrammers have that bag and it's really like aesthetic and YSL and expensive and luxurious but like it's so not practical like if I'm gonna spend a bunch of money on a bag which I have like I have Gucci bags and stuff and Louis Vuitton which by the way if you guys want like a luxury um bag review and stuff because obviously I'm honest about it um let me know because I can do that I have a good little collection but I don't know I just wanted to put that out there because I didn't know that when I bought it so nobody else probably knows it and they don't have to go through the trouble um, and then go through the return process and all that so I just wanted to throw it out there that this bad boy is um, really difficult and not practical and easy and convenient it's just difficult um, so that is my review on the YSL Lulu mini backpack that is the mini one by the way um yeah this video is just really casual like I said I'm sick and I'm about to run out the door to get on a plane to go to New York City um but I hope that you liked it because this was really just about informing this isn't a fancy video but um let me know your thoughts um or if you guys have the bag your experience or if I've helped you swerve buying this bag let me know comment below so all right stay tuned for my new york um city vlog i'm gonna be there for new year's with my best friends it's gonna be so fun and yeah all right bye